Sticky Oven Barbecue Ribs Jump to Recipe Print Recipe Oven Barbecue Ribs Slathered in the most delicious sticky barbecue sauce with a kick of garlic and optional heat. Juicy melt in your mouth oven baked barbecue ribs are fall off the bone delicious. Double up on incredible flavor with an easy to make dry rub first, then coat them in a seasoned barbecue sauce mixture so addictive you won't stop at one. Finger licking good ribs right here. Oven barbecue ribs slathered in the most delicious sticky barbecue sauce with a kick of garlic and optional heat. Juicy melt in your mouth oven baked barbecue pork ribs are fall off the bone delicious. Double up on incredible flavor with an easy to make dry rub first, then coat them in a seasoned barbecue sauce mixture so addictive you won't stop at one. Finger licking good ribs right here. CafeDelights.com ribs. These pork barbecue ribs are a no-fail, hands-down family favorite recipe. There is nothing better than letting your oven do all the work for you, while smelling the incredible barbecue pork aromas drifting all through the house. Sitting down to a plate of steaming hot sticky pork ribs is what's happening this Father's Day for many of our American readers. Get ready for the best ribs of your life. You have all been loving our slow cooker ribs for a few years now, but many of you have asked how to make ribs in the oven. Are you ready? American ribs oven baked and slathered in the most delicious barbecue sauce. CafeDelights.com ribs in the oven. Oven, slow cooker or on the barbecue, pork ribs are so versatile they can be cooked either way. If you love soft, fall off the bone ribs, then go for our slow cooker method. But, if you love juicy, tender and crispy ribs with caramelized edges, then this oven ribs method is for you. How to remove the membrane, skin off baby back ribs. This is a controversial and personal step when cooking ribs. I grew up eating ribs with the skin left on and only started removing them about 10 years ago, advice from a chef. Personally, I love the chewiness of the membrane when left on, but, I also love the ease of eating ribs with it removed. Go with what you love. Turn ribs over with bone, rack side facing up. Carefully slide a blunt knife under the membrane at one end of the rack. Lift to loosen the membrane off of the bone. Using a sheet of paper towel to hold onto the membrane, peel it off the back of the ribs. It should come off in one piece. Oven Barbecue Ribs, CafeDelights.com How to Cook Ribs in the Oven The easiest barbecue ribs besides slow cooking. Prepare ribs as above, then pat them dry with a sheet of paper towel. Rub with our dry rub mixture, recipe below. I like to drizzle some olive oil over them for the best juicy, tender and crispy results. Arrange them on a lined baking tray. You can use foil or parchment paper. Bake for a couple of hours, then slather with our barbecue sauce mixture. Use a brush or spoon to spread it evenly over the tops. Broil or grill for an additional 2 to 5 minutes to get crispy, charred edges. Ribs marinade. Our marinade is only made up for ingredients. Barbecue sauce. Use a good quality barbecue sauce for this recipe. You can use a smoky flavored sauce or regular sauce. I prefer plain, regular barbecue sauce. Garlic, you won't be sorry adding a good kick of garlic to these ribs. Olive oil, a little oil in the sauce gives even crispier, caramelized results when mixed through the barbecue sauce. Worcestershire sauce, adds incredible flavor. For those of you who love a little heat or spice in your life, you can add in chili or cayenne powder. Juicy barbecue ribs in the oven, please my channel subscribe.